What you're looking at here has been my life for the past three days. Just, just this. Like literally, I've been, I've been living right here. What's up, guys? T Mart here, and I've got COVID. Yes, so I wanted to, to update you guys, put a little update video up. Uh, I know the channel has not been popping off. I know we've been missing some videos. I could count on one hand how many days I missed an upload in like the past decade, and I'm, I'm pretty sure two or three of those have come in the past week or so. So I, I, I'm sorry, and uh, I'm, I'm hoping I'm gonna be back soon. <laughs> now don't, don't let me, don't let me tug on your heartstrings too much. Because honestly, it's not that bad. That cough is pretty much all I'm left with. I've got a, a, a fairly nasty cough. It's pretty like inconsistent. It's not like it's here all the time, but when it comes, it doesn't feel good. And then that, that's, is that what she said? Um, and then uh, I've also got like a pretty throbbing headache constantly. So um, that's, that's pretty much it. You know, I, I tested positive two, three days ago. This is day three now. And uh, the first day was rough. The first day was really, really bad. I had pretty much every symptom apart from the shortness of breath and the loss of taste and smell, which fingers crossed, I still have both of those or all three of those. So hopefully they don't go anywhere. I did hear that I think day three or four is typically when you lose those, but um, we'll see what happens. So yeah, first day had everything. Second day, almost everything was knocked off apart from the cough and the headache. And then here on day three, both of those got better again. So honestly, all in all, I feel like it could have been much worse. Um, hopefully we keep trending in the right direction. I have had some nice helpers to keep me company. I don't want to get too close to her because I have heard that there's like some form of COVID that cats can catch. I don't think it's as serious, but I don't want to get her sick. But we've all just been holding down the fort. So um, Chelsea didn't get it. I, I was I was so happy she didn't get it. She tested negative the first day. And then when she did that, I'd sent her out to like an official test, like get with the doctor or whatever, tested negative there. And then she tested negative again the next day. And uh, this week, we were supposed to be going to Texas with her family for like a family vacation type thing. And I was like, all right, you go. I'm not gonna get you sick. We both won't miss it. At least one of us will be there. Like you go, you go have a good time. So I've been holding down the fort. And like I said, this has this literally been all I've been doing. Now I can't lie to you, it's actually been kind of nice. Like, I, I mean, you know, being able to just sit and play video games for fun, watch live streams, kind of veg out a little bit. I usually don't have time to do that because I'm recording so much but I absolutely miss recording for you guys. And I, I know I've been dropping the ball. I know a lot of you guys have been asking for more Guardians, have been asking for more Riders Republic, for more of anything. And I, I mean, it, obviously I, I just, I can't, I can't record right now. We're close. I recorded a little bit today. It felt okay, not great, but I, I think we're close. I think starting tomorrow, I might start being able to ramp it back up. Now this comes with an issue though, because November is absolutely stacked. We've got COD Vanguard, we've got Forza Horizon 5, which actually comes out on November 5th if you have the special edition. We've got the GTA Trilogy. Ooh, I didn't even know there was a Flight Sim DLC coming out. We've got Battlefield 2042. Like we, we've got a ridiculous number of games and then Halo comes right after in early December. COD and Forza, are literally just a couple days away and my main focus is just getting healthy enough to be able to record those. I don't think we're gonna be able to finish some of the series we currently have on the channel, mainly Marvel's Guardians and Riders Republic. And it sucks because they're both games I was really, really enjoying, but they're big games, like they're long. It's a lot of gameplay to be able to beat them and I lost the most important week to be able to play them. And now like, you know, a couple days from now, my focus is obviously gonna be on the new stuff coming out. And then we've got the GTA Trilogy coming out, which has three games on the same day. And that just, it, it stresses me out to no end. So like, I, I, man, I, I've just been a shit YouTuber. I, I've been a really bad YouTuber the past couple weeks. It sucks too, because we were already slowing down due to this. We've had some major work being done on the house, and so like it's been loud, hammering, sawing, whatever else all day. It echoes through the whole house. And I was already not being able to record as much as I would like leading up to getting COVID, it, 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 dude. It's just been like the trifecta, Bermuda Triangle of, of crappy situations to be a YouTuber, but it's, ultimately it's my fault. I can't blame it on anything else. So I just wanted to come on here and let you guys know I'm alive, I'm still here, and try to get, try to get better so I can record videos for you guys, but we might end up having to cancel a couple of series, which is like the cardinal sin of a Let's Play channel. I'm just really not happy about it, so. 
um, we'll, we'll see what happens. In the meantime, it's just going to be me in my little hut here. Just going to keep taking everything I'm taking. I've got uh, acetaminophen here, aka Tylenol. Apparently this is the best one for it. Zinc is supposed to help out a lot. Zycam. This is like a chalky one you're supposed to suck on until it dissolves. It's terrible. Vitamin D. I've also been literally laying out in the sunshine. I've heard that actually helps. Lots of water, of course. And last but not least, black elderberry? I, I don't know. Chelsea got all of this stuff for me and told me the list of things to take. I guess this is supposed to be really good. Coda, I don't think you want this. So yeah, guys, that's, <laughs> that's pretty much it. I just wanted to update you. Hopefully we can get healthy. Cheers to that. And um, I will see you guys on the channel hopefully very soon. Thanks for watching my update and watching me take this. This, this one's actually not that bad. It kind of feels like cough medicine, but it's not bad. Thank you guys for watching. See you later.